What's going on, everybody? The Christmas recap for the Celsius AMA is now. So hope you like it. He starts off by saying that sell almost hit $4, a huge pump, and the reason is because there are more buyers than sellers. And he said that Celsius has zero inflation, no more mining, no more creating tokens, unlike Ethereum and Bitcoin. Alex said that in February, they are going to list sell token on a major exchange. So they are increasing the rate of Bitcoin to 6.2% if you are a platinum user who are international, but the first two Bitcoin in the United States, if you live in the United States, are at 6.2%. And he said that since he's the largest depositor in Celsius, he is making more money by raising the rate. So it is going into his pockets. He's also obviously paying everybody else. $146 million in interest has been paid to date to the members. So talking about XRP, he said that Celsius filed a Reg D with the SEC in 2017, and all of these DeFi projects that have been getting away with no KYC are all going to end up looking like Celsius, everybody getting a KYC and doing AML. So also paying 80% to the members and just doing everything right from the start really separated Celsius from all these other coins that have had a recent dump because of XRP. And Celsius is the fourth largest Bitcoin holder in the world with 50,000 Bitcoin on deposit. And he's saying that there is a direct correlation between the assets under management, which has grown tremendously, and also the price of sell token versus companies like Crypto.com, where most of the value is not paid to the people holding CRO coin, but just to the company and to the founders. Last 30 days, $266 million in net deposits. So they're giving away 10 million sell tokens at the $3 bonus to the employees. So the $1.50 bonus that they did when sell hit $1.50 was much larger. This is going to be a much smaller bonus. And they're doing a three-year vesting for all the employees. So none of these tokens are going to hit the open market anytime soon. He said that sometime in January, the founder and creator of ADA Cardano is going to come on the podcast and do an interview. He says that the price of sell token is not directly tied to the price of Bitcoin, but more so to the number of users and the assets under management that Celsius has. So starting in January, Celsius is going to get income from mining Bitcoin. And since so many people are getting paid in sell token every single week, all the income they are going to be generating from this mining, which is mostly in North America, they're going to have to use that Bitcoin to go ahead and buy sell token, which will boost sell token up even more. He also says that they are increasing how they're earning money with DeFi. And he goes on to say that unless you have a million or a million and a half dollars and you're very technical, you are not going to beat Celsius in terms of how much money you can actually yield from DeFi. It's much better just to keep your money with Celsius and let them earn the interest for you. He's saying that Celsius pays out 50 to 60% more than BlockFi. And he projects to be the second or third largest Bitcoin miner by the end of 2021. So he's showing a chart of CoinGecko showing that most coins are dumping, meaning the price is going down tremendously over the last seven days, whereas Celsius Network is going up. And this has to do with just people's fear that the SEC is going to come after a lot of these other crypto coins. So he's comparing what's happening right now with the SEC kind of cracking down to what happened back in the 90s, where AT&T was literally taking people to court who would plug any unauthorized device into a telephone jack in the wall. But what the SEC said is that for five years, companies that followed all the rules like Celsius Network are not going to be prosecuted or not going to be kind of picked on by the police, which is the SEC of the government for five years. And that's one of the reasons why sell token has gone up 50% so quickly is that people who are in the know and understand what the SEC ruling means is that Celsius is going to be one of the winners. And that's one of the reasons why there's so many restrictions in the United States because they were playing it very, very safe. And Alex said, waiting for the SEC to give safe harbor to companies like Celsius, where even if they are security, they are going to be the ones that will make it out. So here is the green buy wall and the red is the sell wall. You can see there's a huge amount of buying going on. So this is on the Celsians.com website. You can go to stats and find that buyer and seller chart. And there are just definitely more buyers right now than sellers. So now Alex is talking about how over time, he believes that the price of the dollar is going to continue to go down, especially with all of this money printing, like the potential $900 billion per 
proposal that will possibly get passed. And people are going to be looking for scarce assets. And he's saying that because sell token is at a 20 market cap coin or below that a lot of these new funds coming online by default have to buy sell token because they're in the top 20. And he's saying that it's not that crypto is doing so well, it's that the dollar is doing so poorly. So people are looking for scarce assets. He's saying that if you want to translate some of this content into your native language, you can go to celsiushub.com and you can then contribute some articles or even videos into your native language. And if you go to celsius.network and you click why trust Celsius, you can see all of the licenses and all of the regulations that were filed. So Alex is saying because of this SEC ruling of giving crypto companies safe harbor, Celsius doesn't really need to do anything, whereas other companies have to go back and file all sorts of things and kind of do what they should have done at the very beginning of starting their company, whereas Celsius has done everything by the books from the very beginning because Alex knew this was going to happen. And he's saying that so many other companies like Nexo are copying what Celsius has done just because they realize that Celsius did it right from the beginning. So there are two sources to get extra news. One is celsiusnetwork.medium.com. The other is mashinsky.medium.com. Alex said that every single American owes $250,000 of debt to essentially the nation because our nation is so much in debt, trillions of dollars in debt. So regarding XRP, right now they are not being forced to delist XRP, but they're kind of just waiting to see what the regulators tell them. So this is a video that Alex did yesterday on NASDAQ. So one update is if you have a story of how Celsius has really affected your life, you can email kim at celsius.network and they will schedule an interview with you to tell your story. So Alex is talking a little bit about this new money with people driving Lamborghinis and flashing cash versus old money, people who don't spend all their money but are living off of the interest from their principal. And he's just, again, encouraging people to take that mindset of old money, not just buy frivolous stuff, but actually invest that. So Alex has just been talking about how amazing this community is to spread the hope, spread the love, spread the gratitude around, uh, take it out of this community of Celsius Network and bring it to other people in other areas of your life that uh, really could use it right now. There's a lot of people suffering in different ways right now in the world. And he and his wife are just talking about how incredible this company is and what they see for the vision of this company and how it can really impact all sorts of people around the world. And also how that everybody earns the same on Celsius. There are no special interests, which is really unique in making money or in the banking system that does not exist you can have $10 and live in Bangladesh, as he said, and you're getting paid the same interest as he is on his money. The first question is, is there a limit on the amount of loans you can take? And Alex is like, nope, if you want a $20 million loan, you can take it. The next question is, do you think they'll have a new Bretton Woods and create a new financial system? He says that even if that were to happen, they're still printing so much money so fast and we're not feeling it is because all the countries are printing at the same speed. So the dollar is going to continue to lose its value no matter what. So he's saying they did a deal with a company with several hundred million users, but Alex can't yet really talk about that, but he will soon. Somebody asked that if you take a loan out and you give BTC as collateral, are you still earning interest on that collateral? And Alex said, no, you're not, because they use that BTC to lend it out. And that's how the company earns money. And Alex wants everybody to take loans out. That's how the company makes a lot of money. New promo code Santa, S-A-N-T-A, transfer $500. And you are going to get a $25 reward after 30 days. Somebody asked about using a beneficiary or putting down a beneficiary in case you die. And Alex said that they are working on that in the app, but still you want to have a will and talk with a lawyer to make sure that it's all done properly. Alex said that in the February release that you'll be able to use multi-collateral loans. So you can use your entire portfolio to take loans against versus now it has to be one loan per crypto that you're using as collateral. So there's a new tab in the app for taxes. He said that those of us living in the United States will have a very easy time doing taxes. They partnered with a company. So that's pretty cool. So Alex is talking about his investment portfolio again. So about half or a little bit more than half in digital economy stocks. So Alex said that his lifetime mission and Celsius is not something he's just doing part time or for a little while is to really drain the power from these special interests and from the banks. So somebody asked, when will you be done with Celsius or when will Celsius have kind of completed what it's here to do? And Alex said, basically, never because there's billions of people and the banks have all the power and there's a way to make the world a better place. And it's through what Celsius is doing. So somebody asked about a video by Trillions, a YouTube station, which had a very, very high sell price. I think it was like $100 a sell. 
And Alex said that he can't predict the price of sell. It really has to do with buyers and sellers. So if more and more people want to buy, sell, and no one wants to sell it, then the price is going to go up. But he can't predict really what's going to happen. So somebody asked, what is it about Celsius that's allowed them to be profitable month after month, whereas other companies are just burning through the investment money? And the biggest difference is that the 20% of income that Celsius keeps for themselves is enough to pay all their expenses. Alex is saying that depending on what country you live in, you can make fiat deposits in the app. He said that Spark is not going to be affected by what's going on with XRP. Alex said that they still need more people to join the team. You can join the job fair. They are hiring 25 more people at the call center just for this big announcement, this big partnership that they haven't yet released, but that is huge. All right, guys, that is the end of the AMA recap. Go ahead and go to Webull to get your four free stocks, which end the end of the year if you are in the United States. Thanks for watching. Until next time, talk with you soon and bye for now.